Charlie just had a community day and today we will be using the third stage evolution Star Raptor in the Go Battle League in the Great League Alright, so hi hi to all of you guys So first of all, I'd like to apologize for the poor lighting because it's the best lighting that I could get here in this accommodation But nevertheless, let's go ahead to check out how this uh, Shadow Star Raptor performs in the Great League. So this is the Shadow Star Raptor that I've actually evolved during the community day with the IVs 111 and 14. It's rank 11 according to stadiumgaming.com according to the rank checker. In uh, I, I guess with its IVs and these are the moves that it has. Gust, the community day move, the fast move, um, close combat and also brave bird. So the thing about this Pokemon though, let's go ahead and check out pvpoke.com. Alright, thank you very much pvpoke.com for all the information and if you were to check out under Great Lake and type STAR <laughs> Staravia in the shadow form, the second stage evolution of Starly actually ranks way better than what we're going to use today, Star Raptor. As it's ranked 457, following up with the non-shadow form Staravia, it's 469, whereas Star Raptor with the community they move Gust actually is ranked 487 and the non-shadow form is actually 531 so hence I decided to use the shadow one um, in the great link instead as it's ranked almost 50 ranks higher so let's go ahead and uh, check this out though we have to power it up first not purifying it all right that we do not want to make a mistake we're gonna power it up to 1500 CP to be eligible in the ultra league really really awesome so the interesting thing about this Pokemon though it actually has really really interesting moves that I'm gonna show you guys under here uh, using the Elite Charge DM, let's go ahead and do it with this. And you guys can see it actually has Heat Wave also. So close combat and Heat Wave, really, really interesting moves. Um, you can actually hit like Ice or even Rock-type Pokemon with super effective damage with close combat. So hence why it's pretty useful. Uh, but we're going to see how glassy this Pokemon is, I assume so. Of course, it's not going to be as glassy as Honchkrow. But still, let's see how it goes. So anyway, I'm going to pair it up with Medicham and also Sable while using the same old moves uh, counter, Ice Punch and also Psychic for Medicham whereas um, the Purified Sable I will be using um, Shadow Claw Return and also Foul Play. So we're going to go ahead with our very first battle right now and we got matched up against Registry. A very good start for our Medicham man. Alright, <clears throat> so we're just going to stay put. Switching into Swampert, which I am going to switch into the uh, Star Raptor. Let's see how much damage this does. Alright, we managed to sneak in a second uh, Gust. I'm going to let this go through. Let's see how much damage a Hydro Cannon does to a Shadow Star Raptor. That was not fun. That was very painful to see. Okay, well, let's go ahead with Close Combat. Wow. Wow. Whoa. It's like as if a, a, a Talent Flame in the Ultra League getting hit by a Hydro Cannon from his Swampert also. Wow, that, that wasn't fun. That, that was really not fun. Uh, okay. Wow. Wow. Okay. Wow. That was painful to see. Okay. It's okay. Let's go ahead and bring in Medicham now. Okay, we're going to farm down the uh, Registeel. Hopefully, um, we're going to go with Psychic because Psychic will deal more damage as it has same type attack bonus. Alright, it's a more energy efficient charge move to use as compared to Ice Punch since both the moves will be doing resisted damage anyways. Alright. Thinking if I want to shield this though. Uh... Let's go with the shield. Alright, Zed Cannon. Awesome. Did my attack fall? Yes, it did. We're going to switch into that because we are also going to faint from that. Alright. So not a very good uh, thing right now for us with the Wiggly Tough. Okay, in play. Okay, this is not very good, guys. It's very, very bad, guys. We've got two Pokemon that are weak to uh, Fairy, which in this situation we are getting taken down. So what? Why didn't she shield? If I'm him, I would actually shield knowing that actually I I mean, I mean right right now, even if he doesn't shield, he's gonna just charm me down. Even if I were to use my charge move, he's just gonna charm me down. That wasn't nice. But yeah, you guys can see how glassy the Star Raptor is, so hence why it doesn't really have the bulk to handle a lot of things. Let me change my team up a bit. I do not want to have two Pokemon as weak to a uh, fairy. I'm gonna bring in Galarian Stunfisk instead. Uh, hopefully that's better. Okay, here we go. Yeah, this um now I have one that resists fairy, alright? So we got matched up against Power Power, okay? Let's see uh, what he has for us. Shadow Swampert, okay? Uh, pretty okay for us, of course. Uh, we do not want our Scalarian Stunfist to face up against it. Okay, we're just gonna go with uh, 
our counters first. Okay, Hydro Cannon coming in, thinking if I want to shield this or not. I'm going to let the first Hydro Cannon go through. And then we will see if I want to go with Psychic or Ice Sponge Bait. Uh, I'm going to go with the Ice Sponge Bait because I... Okay, he decided to switch into Drapion. I'm going to go with Ice Sponge right now. Okay, I think I can switch into my Galarian Stun Face right, uh, right after this. Let's see. Okay, I'm going to switch now. And then uh, we will see how things goes. Alright, alright, going pretty okay. I'm gonna let this go through. Even if it's Aqua Tail, it's totally fine. We should be able to survive pretty okay. Okay, it's Crunch, want to debuff us. Okay, not happening. Very good for us, that's good. Another charge move coming. I'm gonna let this go through, do another three uh, mud shots before I actually use my Earthquake. Maybe even Rock Slide. Is Rock Slide enough? Maybe not. But we're gonna go with that. Okay, just two, just two. Two should be enough. Okay, good. Let's go with the Earthquake right now. Okay, this will take out the uh, Drapion. And uh, okay, now he's probably going to bring in the Galarian, uh, not Galarian, but the Swampert. <laughs> Galarian Swampert. Is that a new Pokemon? Galarian Swampert. Wow, that would be quite interesting to see. Okay, okay, the Swampert is back. Can I, can I see it? Okay, we got the Earthquake, but one CMP tie, obviously, because the attack stat of a Shadow Swampert is way higher than the Galarian Stunfisk. Galarian Stunfisk is just bulky. Alright, but uh, I think, you know what, I'm going to go with rocks. Oh, what? I was tapping rocks. Like, what? Hello? I was trying to switch the rocks, but the screen just immediately flashed to the earthquake portion. Okay, I'm going to bring in Medicham again. I'm going to go with Ice Punch now, straight away. Right after doing one counter. Let's see if he actually shields this or not. Okay, and he shields that. Okay, so he wants his uh, Swampert to be alive, but not happening, bro. Okay, bring it in... Uh, Skamori, which is kind of okay, I think. Okay, let him farm me down. And then I'm thinking if, um, if I want to bring in the uh, Star Raptor or the Galarian Stunfisk. Because uh, it doesn't have a lot of health for the Galarian Stunfisk, but is my Rock Slide ready? Uh, no, it's not ready, right? Because I just used the uh, Earthquake. So, no, I have to bring this in. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna have to shoot this. Yeah, I'm thinking guys. Wow, this is quite tough. Okay, this is quite tough. We are gonna have to farm our energy up. Okay, we're gonna go with the close combat. Taking out the Swampert. See whether, not Swampert, Skamori. See whether we can actually catch the Hydro Cannon on the Galarian Stunfisk. Okay, it's gonna be tough to catch that though. Okay, yep, I knew it. Okay, not good. Not good. He should just uh, not take me out okay but hopefully i can get to a rock slide before i uh, know no 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 doesn't look wow guys the bird is too slow yeah i can feel it the star raptor is just too slow you can't get to his moves and the gas damage is high but too slow well it's okay we will try it out again hopefully um we can at least win one match because doesn't seem to be a really really uh, useful Pokemon in my opinion for what I can see right now in the last two battles. Alright, we got matched up against Moru. Okay, let's see what he has. Cruselia, an okay start for us, I would say. Okay, okay. But uh, of course, uh, he's still at a, on a slight advantage over us as uh, Moonblast would do. Super effective damage to us. Okay, so I'm um, thinking if I want to try and catch the Moonblast. On my Galarian stun fist though. Hmm. Okay, we will try that. We will try that. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna shoot this first. I believe it's Moonblast. Uh huh. And it is Moonblast. Alright, we're gonna try and catch the next Moonblast on the Galarian stun fist, like I said. Okay, let's go with another Ice Punch first. Okay. Okay. Looks pretty okay. <laughs> and then, uh, okay. Gonna go with the switch right now. Oh, too slow. Another moon blast. I'm gonna double shoot the Medicham, man. Gonna double shoot the Medicham. Yep, okay, moon blast again. Ouch. Okay, moon blast is really, really quick because of the psycho card. It charges up energy super duper quickly. Okay, looking okay. Okay. And uh, she decided. he decided to shoot that. <coughs> moon blast coming in, not good for us. 
Can I actually use Gust alone to farm down the Cresselia? That's now the question I'm asking myself. Okay. You know what? I'm going to bring this in. Let's see what I can do. Come on, Star Raptor. Show us something great. Um, um, I mean, that could have been better if you actually managed to take it down the Cresselia without getting hit by any charge moves at all. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh, we survived that. Oh, uh, that's not surprising. Okay, let's see what's he gonna bring in. I'm definitely gonna get to my charge move. Oh, oh okay, that that did not work. That did not work. That was really bad. That was not good at all. <coughs> that was not good at all. Especially with Scrafty in the house or so. Not good. Not good at all. The guys did a, a good chunk of damage onto the Scrafty though, but this is not going to be enough. Power Up Punch is just going to come my way against my Galanus Sunfist all the way. Alright, and then uh, we're going to get taken up by this Scrafty. Hmm, not good at all guys. Quite tough man, I must say, to actually uh, use the Star Raptor. You know, I'm not even going to bother to use my Charge Move anymore, right? although I just stepped it a little bit, so it should be activated already. Um, but yeah, he's definitely gonna shoot this. I'm 99% confident he's gonna shoot this, guys. Alright, so let's see the shoot, bro. Alright, thank you very much. Oh, oh, well, he did not shoot that. Okay, okay sorry, I, I, I failed that 1%. Uh, but it doesn't make a difference, guys, because he still have one Pokemon with full health. Uh, it could have just counted me down. Yep. Um, anyway, he's just gonna save the last shoot for the next Pokemon, and he's still gonna take me out, so not so good. Hmm. Maybe I should uh, lead with... Uh, Galarian Stunfist this time, just to see if it works. Uh-huh. Actually, you know what? Let's bring in Swampert instead. I'm going to bring in Double Ground users. Yeah, my Swampert, I'm not going to use the Shadow. I'm going to use the Non-Shadow one. Alright. As uh, Sometimes I feel the Non-Shadow one is better than the Shadow one in certain scenarios as it can survive slightly better. Alright, Altaria. Uh, in this situation, both ain't good at all. The Shadow or the Non-Shadow. So the Galarian Stunfist would be better anyways. Okay. But it's okay. I have Sludge Wave. So let's see if he actually... Uh, gets hit by the sludge wave at all okay and we're gonna go with uh, the first sludge wave right now okay straight away going with it not even bothering to charge up any more energy all right you guys saw weak connection yep i'm not too sure why you know i'm using the hotel's wi-fi all right so that did a good amount of damage and then the sky attack should be coming in soon i'm gonna shoot this okay we're gonna charge up until we fire off a second uh, sludge wave okay hopefully Hopefully, okay, okay, very good, very good. Let's go with the next sludge wave. I'm gonna try and catch this guy attack on the Galarian Stunfish. I really would like to do that. That would be great. Okay, nope, he shielded that, good. Okay, um, I'm gonna double shoot the Swampert now. I think it's more useful than this Star Raptor. Yeah, despite both being a comedy day Pokemon, okay? Yeah. So let's go with another sludge wave. Hopefully we can get to it before we faint. Okay, that's great. <clears throat> and then, uh, I think, you know what? I'm just going to let him take me out. It doesn't matter even if he uses his charge move or not later on. Okay, now, very good. <coughs> we are both our shoes, guys. Which is great, but also not great. Okay, it's Azul Mario. Hmm. Azul Mario, guys, what should I do? I do not know, man. I am not good, man. All right, we're going to go with one Earthquake first. And then we're going to switch into Star Raptor. We do not want to get hit by a Hydro Cannon. Hydro Palm, I mean. Hydro Cannon. Azumaru doesn't have Hydro Cannon, bro. Alright, so we're going to go with that. Let's see. Um, uh, I just wish he does not have Ice Beam. So let's see. No Ice Beam, please. Okay, it is Hydro Palm. That is why you do not want to use that. Okay, because it's just super duper glassy. Wow, that, that was painful to see. I have a very big problem right now, guys. I don't think this earthquake is going to be enough to take up the Azumar hand. And then, I don't think I can farm it. Oh, it is enough. Okay, good. So let's see what's the last Pokemon. Uh, very bad, guys. It's Medicham. Yeah, um, you, you, bro, you can just take me out already. Yeah, I, I mean, if I still have the Star Raptor, it'd be great. I can handle the Medicham, but no. Alright. So, um, I, I don't see Star Raptor being really that useful. No, no good. That's not good. Let me change my team again. Hang on. Alright guys, I've decided to bring in Warren. Warren with Medicham. Okay, hopefully it works. Hopefully it works. Okay, hopefully it works. 
I think this is the last battle already, or second last battle, I can't remember. Nick Kitty, thank you very much for the battle. Why am I even thanking him, man? <laughs> yeah, I do not know. Anyway, got matched against a purified stable eye. Okay, pretty okay start for us. Better than our Medicham facing up against it. Okay, we're gonna go with uh, Icicle Spears all the way. Um, thinking if I wanna shield this or not. Uh, I'm gonna let this go through. Alright, I can save the shield for Medicham anyways. Alright, foul play. Ouchie, ouchie, but it's totally fine. Okay, we're gonna go with uh, Icicle Spear now. He managed to sneak in another Shadow Claw. Alright, let's go with Icicle Spear first. Boing, okay. And then, uh, okay, he decided to shoot. Uh, he thought that I was gonna go with Earthquake, but we're gonna go with another Icicle Spear now. Let's see if he's gonna shoot this or not. Okay, do not want the next foul play to come in. Okay, cool. And then, uh, okay, that did a good amount of damage. Let's see if he's gonna take me out with just a foul place alone or what. Okay, yes. Hmm, thinking, guys. I'm thinking. I'm thinking. I'm thinking. I'm thinking. Would counter be fast enough to take it out? Okay, managed to sneak in the counter. I probably have to shoot this. Okay, because the gas would actually not be able to take it out in time and it's returned so uh, the counter took it out okay swampert shadow swampert to be exact I'm gonna charge up to psychic hydro cannon is coming in I'm gonna let the first one go through okay charge up to psychic fire off ice punch and then we will see how okay ice punch is ready let's go okay okay uh hopefully he takes the bait though come on okay okay shield please Okay, good. Let's go bring in Star Raptor right now. Okay. Come on, get some gas damage in, bro. Get some gas damage in. I'm thinking if I want to shoot this. <clears throat> I think I'm going to shoot this. Okay. Let's see if it works or not. Let's see. Okay, let's bring in the other Pokemon as Needle Queen. And Needle Queen, alright. Uh, oh, okay. Okay. It, it's very painful. I can see the damage coming in like crazy. Okay, I'm thinking guys, I'm thinking. Okay, let's go with close combat. I do not know if it's enough to take it out, but I do not want to take it out at the same time. Okay. Okay, don't take it out. Okay, good. Very good. Okay, come take me out. Okay, great. Now, come, let's go. Let's take out the uh, Needle Queen, please. Thumb down Needle Queen. Okay. Very, very good, Medicham. Okay, we need one Psychic onto the Swampert and it should be out. If I actually... <coughs> Got excellent on that close combat and took out the Needle Queen. He can actually farm down my Star Raptor with the Swampert and then after Hydro Cannon, my Medicham. So that was the win condition that I could see just now. And we finally won one battle with the legendary Star Raptor. Alright, so um, that is all that I have to show to you guys in this video, man. It was a crazy win, but insane losses also. Um, if you ask me if I would recommend to use this Pokemon Star Raptor in the Go Battle League at all, the answer is a big fat no. Alright, you guys can see that it's not really that useful. In fact, if you were to use it in the Flying Cup also, it's not really that ideal because all the other Flying Type Pokemon will not be weak to Flying Type moves and also Fighting Type moves. So it's not that useful, alright? Okay, so hopefully you guys have enjoyed watching me use uh, the Shadow Star Raptor in the Go Battle League in the Great League. If you guys enjoyed this video, definitely leave a like on the video. Be much appreciated. Thank you very much. And I'll see you guys in the next episode in the next video, alright? Star Raptor, it's time to say goodbye. I'll never use you again, although you have a new community today move. But no, I, I can't use you. I'd rather use BG. Yeah, I need to be loyal to PP, okay? Yeah, PG next time. Mega PG next time. Yeah, alright? So goodbye, goodbye, good. Bye!